Hey guys, so today I'm going to be bringing you swatches of two more holiday palettes from Smashbox. If you guys are curious to see how they swatch and what I think, then just keep watching. Okay, so in front of me I have the Holidays Be Legendary Lipstick and Lip Mattifier set, which looks like this. Beautiful gold packaging, same as their contour palette. And their Holidays Always On Eyeliner set. It says one full-size liquid eyeliner and four full-size gel eyeliners. I don't think I've used Smashbox eyeliners before. At least the pencils I don't think I've used. So I'm curious to see what I think of these, and this is what it looks like. The eyeliner set retails for $39 and is a $94 value. That's pretty awesome. And then the lipstick, the lipstick gift set is $29 with a $116 value. Wow. So this is an even better value. So one, two, three, four, five lipsticks and a mattifier. So we will dive into these. I think their lipsticks are really nice, but this packaging is what's getting me. I just, I mean, the design is so cute. So let's start off with the eyeliners since they don't usually take as long. We have the always on liquid liner in black, always on liquid liner in fishnet, in brood, nymph, and bubbly. It shows you the shades on the very top of the box. This is what they look like. The really fun kind of zigzaggy, I don't know what you want to call it. It's just really cute. Kind of like psychedelic packaging. Seems like a lot of companies are going psychedelic for the holidays. NYX had their sugar trip and it was all like wavy lines and neon colors. Smashbox is wavy lines and neon colors. Is there a trend going on? Anyway, let's pop these out. So first off, we have Bubbly, which I think is like a champagne shade. Right here is Bubbly. It is like a champagne, it's really pretty. Next up, we have Fishnet, which I don't know if this is black or gray. It looks like a black shade. These are very soft. Do they come with sharpeners? No. So you have to get a pencil sharpener to sharpen them. Next up is Brood, which obviously sounds like a coffee shade. It's a deep, deep, deep brown, could probably pass for black. And Nymph, which is purple, I believe. Yeah, it's like a deep plum purple, really pretty. And then I'm assuming this is their liquid liner. It looks very fancy. Um, always on liquid eyeliner. Okay, and it comes with a tip like this. Nice, you can get a skinny line, you can get a fatter line. Nice. I will probably be saving this one for later because I already have a lot of liquid liners out at the moment. I wanna try Brood along the top lash line and I think I wanna try Bubbly in the water line. So let's try Brood first. It's hard with mascara already on. That definitely helped to intensify this lash. Just made it really dark and look a lot fuller. So I'm gonna do the same thing on the other lash line. There, now I have that like smoky lash line that I look for. And then let's try bubbly in the water line. I don't think that it's as visible because it's a metallic. If it were like a matte cream, I feel like you would see it really well. Maybe we can try it on the inner portion of my top lid. Okay, so I put it right here and you still really can't see this on my skin tone. So for me, this one's probably a pass. I mean, it looks really pretty, but it's just not showing up on me. It's not really showing up on my skin. It's not showing up in the waterline. But these other colors are really nice. I like that they're so dark that you could use them as like a smoky liner when you want that smoky look. So I would say four out of five thumbs up for me. 
All right, now let's move on to this lipstick set, which is really pretty. So these are the five lipsticks you get in here. You have Pretty Social. They show you the colors again on top. Honey, Legendary, 9 to 5, and Deal Breaker. So we will try all of these today. I thought that I had Legendary in my collection already, but I must have given it to a friend or family member. They come wrapped like this. Oh, the packaging is so cute. Look at this. Can you guys see it? And then it says Smashbox. Now, this is definitely something I would display. That's really cute. And then the Insta Matte Lipstick Transformer. Tap on with finger over cream lipstick, FYI, not for use with glosses, lacquers, or balms. That makes sense. All right, so let's swatch. All right, so I'm going to start off with Honey, which is like the, oh, can you guys see the design on the actual lipstick bullet? It has like squiggly lines all over it. It's really cute. Okay, so that is adorable. That's just an added surprise that I did not know about. But anyway, let's swatch Honey. Oh, okay, this is like a creamy formula. So here's Honey. Here's Honey. Next up, we have Pretty Social, which is the pink one. Again, with the adorable design on it. Pretty Social looks like a bubblegum pink right now. These have just like a little bit of a like glossy shine to them. They're not super glossy, they're just comfortable. So here is Pretty Social. It's a very wearable pink. I thought it was gonna be like Barbie pink. But this is a really nice like cool tone neutral, I would say. Next up, let's try the bright pink. This is called Nine to Five. Oh, I love it, I love it. I only need a one swipe with that one, nine to five. Here's nine to five. It's very bright. I don't know if I can pull off these bright pinks. I like them. I just don't know if I can do it. Next up, we have Legendary, which I think is the color that Be Legendary is based off of. This nice bright red. It's more of like a pinky toned red, like a cool tone red. So here is Legendary. And the final lipstick in this collection is Deal Breaker, which looks like a deep plum shade. Maybe not as deep as I thought. <laughs> there it is. So here is Deal Breaker. I don't think this is the shade for me, but this one does seem very glossy. So let's try out this Insta Matte Lipstick Transformer. It says pat on to mattify. So it has like a lip gloss tube, but they don't, they say to apply it to a finger and then pat it on. Wow, okay, this is the glossy side. This is the glossy side. This is the side that I use the mattifier on. It really does work. Wow. I mean, look at this. Matte. Glossy. That's wild. Okay, so 
This definitely works. And it feels like it has like an added layer of gloss on this side, surprisingly. Like there's more slip. So there, now it is all mattified. So let me give you my opinions of these kits. I think that the Holidays the Legendary Lipstick Kit is really nice. I think it's a really, really good price. I mean, one of these lipsticks almost is the price of the entire kit. I don't see how this can be $29, but this is an amazing value. I would definitely recommend this for yourself, for friends, add it to your wish list, add it to your shopping list. Really good set. The Always On Eyeliner Set. It's okay. It's not like mind blowing. There are four basic color liners and a black liquid liner. I mean, they're nice, they're easy to use, but I feel like Urban Decay has liner sets that are coming out. Wet n Wild has liners, Essence has liners. Like there's just so many different companies now that have eyeliners that are affordable, that these colors are not that unique, that I feel like you need to run out and buy this one in particular. So if I had to pick between the two, I would say get the lipstick collection over the liner collection, unless you just love Smashbox liners. It's totally up to you, just my suggestions, my opinions. So I hope you guys found this swatch and try on video helpful. If you did, please give this video a thumbs up, subscribe to my channel, and as always, I will see you in my next video. Bye guys.